Hello and welcome to new lecture. In previous lecture, we were defining different load cases. So if you have an open load case manager, you can just close it and you can find your load case manager here. And if you want to recall him, just view edit definition and everything you made is here. It's not lost because we're going to use this later. But now we have to define our mesh. In the previous chapter, we were showing just how to create a mesh, some simple mesh. But in lectures in this chapter, we're going to try to create and manipulate with mesh quality. We can manipulate with mesh quality, changing the size of the uh, elements and changing the number of the elements and nodes. To measure the quality of mesh, we have to define aspect ratio. Aspect ratio measures the element quality. So the biggest is aspect ratio, the biggest is distortion of the element, and the lower is aspect ratio, then the elements are shaped well. So let's create a mesh. Let's go to mesh. Let's click on the create mesh. So as we explained before here, we can manipulate max density. But we can go here mesh parameters so we can leave it in the middle and here we can define the mesh size and we have default dimensions 6.1 millimeters and 0.3 millimeters um, so let's click ok and let's see what kind of mesh we're gonna get and this is our first mesh let's go to mesh right click and let's go to details and here we have some information. We have element size 6.1, 0 0.3. We have mesh quality high. We have total nodes 12,000. We have total elements 7,000. And we have maximum aspect ratio 8.7. So, for example, let's go to mesh. Now let's create a mesh plot and here we can create a plot of aspect ratio so let's click on the aspect ratio and okay and now we have here that our biggest aspect ratio as we saw it's 8.7 and the smallest is 1.05 so we try to look for where our biggest aspect ratio is and this is here in those areas and we can manipulate the element size to get the lowest aspect ratio uh, as we can to get a better result in the simulation now as you see on the left side on the under mesh quality we have our plot let's go to mesh and let's click on the create mesh and let's put here for our element size 3 and click OK and now we see we have smaller elements and now if we go to our aspect ratio double click so let's go to mesh quality and details and now we see that we have total elements 49,000 and our maximum aspect ratio is 12 and before was about 8 and 9 so we actually got the worst case scenario so we can go to our mesh create a mesh and we can put I don't know maybe 8 size of the element run again double click on aspect ratio and we have 18 so let's go to create mesh and let's leave it as it was 6 we need something 8.7 and this is this is not so uh, bad this is pretty much good for us so we're gonna leave it like this with a maximum aspect ratio 8.7 
So this is example how you can measure quality of your mesh with aspect ratio.